Welcome to Out This Week Video Edition. You're watching The Hand That Feeds HQ and this is what's out this week among Mel CU music releases. <laughs> This is a big week. After weeks and weeks of digital releases and even empty weeks of releases, we finally have an exciting week bubbling with a wide variety of music to enjoy. We have long-awaited comebacks and some other pretty cool stuff in the mix. First off, we have Gran Rodeo tribute album Rodeo Freak. Now, I am a big fan of Gran Rodeo, been following their career since 2010 and I must say that time really flew by. They were a band that no one knew outside of the anime fandom and now they have some of the most iconic and popular bands in Japan covering their songs. Talk about a well-deserved recognition. From the previews, this is going to be a pretty interesting tribute album, so make sure to get it if you can. Also, happy 15th anniversary to the awesome Gran Rodeo! Then we have High Tide with Highlight Blue. If you're into EDM and still have to check out Handed Anthem, High Tide's upcoming release is going to be a pretty good introduction. High Tide are one of the four groups that share the exact same voice cast in the Handed Anthem franchise. The group counts with the vocals of Shohei Komatsu, Takeaki Masuyama, Takuya Masumoto and Kento Hama. Highlight Blue blends catchy pop lyrics with hyped up synth melodies making this an easy listening introduction to EDM. Hiro Shimono, We Go Out of all the artists releasing music this month, Shimono has been the unluckiest. His second full-length album, We Go, has been postponed twice already and it finally gets to see the light of day this week. Shimono brings his edgy rock sound to the spotlight and has quite a few surprises in this release worth checking out. Tasuku Hatanaka History And the prince of dance music among most of you is back! Tasuku Hatanaka makes his comeback with the fourth single, History. It has been a long time since Hatanaka released his awesome and totally recommended album Fighter in 2019. Since then, fans have been eagerly waiting for his comeback and, as it has been a trend, Hatanaka is back in the summer with yet another dreamy and danceable single. Lent has already released a short version of the music video for the title track, so make sure to check that out. Also releasing music this week is Soma Saito with Summerholic. Saito has been experimenting with his music and is now in the second entry in his digital single In Bloom series, one that it is darker and rooted in the concept of changing seasons. The first one, Petricor, was all about the rainy season. Summerholic, however, is going to be the very first summer-inspired song coming from Saito. Knowing how he usually goes the dark route instead of the peppy, happy-go-lucky summer vibes route, fans are anticipating this release, yet they do not know what to expect. Well, you can expect double entendre lyrics and a twist or two as per usual, other than that, we'll have to wait until the preview is released. <music> Lastly, we have My Milky Way with Sayai Koihaku. The shuffle group consisting of Yutu Suzuki, Ken and Toshiki Someya is back with their fourth single. This is part of the ongoing One Dream digital single series from the marginal number 4 Pythagoras 
production franchise. As per usual, cover art and previews only dropped this week, so be on the lookout on your social media or if you're following the hand at FitzHQ, please wait for an update on the website. Aside from Soma Saito's Summerholic and my Milky Way's Sayai Koihaku, that of course are both being distributed exclusively on online stores in Japan, all other releases can be purchased on CD Japan. Links will be in the description below, so make sure to check those out. Please subscribe and don't forget to hit the notifications bell so that you don't miss another weekly shot of MailCU music content. Thanks for watching.